Good evening, everybody. I know I usually give you a heads up that I'm coming in just so I can make sure there's people that pop in, but um, I've got to go get water for horses because it is 40 degrees outside. And I thought I would do this now because I am making myself a little drink. I have this really cool water bottle from the Young Living Foundation. It is like amazing. It keeps everything cool, just like I like it. Uh, but I wanted to show you the little Ningxia Red kit that I got. So from the spring catalog, nice Ningxia Red, a, a box of two. And we already made them. Actually, my little guy did. It's the ice cube trays. And it's really cute because it's the, the lemon shape. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. Um, fresh squeezed lemon. So that's what we did here. So I get my, I use these organic lemons from Superstore. And we just squeeze them out. We use the uh, juicer. Just one of these good old fashioned juicers. One of my wonderful members in Box Hall found it at a garage sale for me. She got me two actually. One for grapefruits, one for lemons and oranges. So anyways, I want to show you this drink that I kind of stumbled upon. But again, these, this little kit that comes with the ice cube, the silicone ice cube tray. You can make gummies in it. It comes with a lemon uh, plus oil. So you can add this to your water or you could add it to your little ice cube tray if you want. I probably would just put it in my water, like mix it up and then pour it in um, with your fresh squeezed lemon, few drops of lemon oil, because the oil does come from the rind, not from the juice, right? Um, so, and then you get your Ningxia Red. Two bottles, the ice cube slash gummy maker, and your bottle of lemon, your five mil. Now this stuff is, like this is a super good deal because this was like, I think $99 or something. So for two bottles, which if you did an ounce a day, lasts about 25 days. Now, the amount of, this is basically whole foods in a bottle. You get all your trace minerals, your vitamins, um, amino acids, which are tough to get sometimes in different foods because of processing, and sometimes not enough of the right foods are we consuming. Um, amino acids. Glutathione is really, you get lots of glutathione out of, you have to Google it. I don't want to take up too much of the time explaining because I don't want to bore people, but glutathione is big, huge, huge value. And Ironically, there's other amino acids that in the current times, there is lots of details. Um, the FDA has pulled off a natural amino acid supplement called NAC. I won't give the long term because I might butcher it, but um, it actually works to help the body use the glutathione. Glutathione actually helps to detoxify the body. Now, Detoxifying the body is very huge, especially it's every day because the things that we get inundated with between what we breathe in, what we put on our body, what we put in our body and like the environmental circumstance right now. Okay. To be as compliant as possible. So to increase your Ningxia Red will help detoxify your body on a cellular level. Lots of the gunk that we have in our bodies is stored on the outer layer of our cells. And that's the fatty layer. So when people tend to lose, um, release weight, sometimes they feel yucky first because we're actually releasing all of that. So Ninja Red is helping stock your body with lots of glutathione, which helps detoxify the body. And what it does is it actually, because of the sulfur molecules, in glutathione, it actually helps bind to those toxins. So sulfur is needed to get those toxins out of your body as well. So that's why using this stuff is amazing. But the lemon also, warm lemon water in the morning, very detoxifying as well. But what I did, so not only, so I'm gonna drop in, I'm gonna make one for myself right now. So I just, you just kind of squeeze it out and I have it out a little bit, so. And just like really the cutest, I don't know if you can see the little design on the bottom. So I'm gonna just drop it in and I'm gonna add water, obviously. Um, and an ounce of Ningxia Red. So this water bottle here that I have, this one here that I got from foundation, um, bear with me. It's 500 and some, no, sorry, 709 mils. So awesome. 
and my this is about an ounce and a half so just you know do that pour it in and, and then I'm just gonna add water to fill most of it. But the other thing I wanted to share with you, ashwagandha root tea. Now, in my studies, I ran through, came across this one a lot. Very popular in Ayurvedic medicine. It's actually considered the jing, ginseng of Ayurvedic, which is a lot of the, from India, that it's like one of their most popular um, or most commonly used herbs. And immune support, it's called an adaptogen. So I want you to do a little research on this so I can stay as compliant as possible. But um, de detoxifies the body. It helps to immune system support in a very large way. It helps for women's monthly functions to balance out. And it's actually helped with stamina and energy. So it's actually considered like a ginseng. But... Um, in the current environment right now, I don't know if some of you are familiar or aware of some of the talk around proteins, and I'll leave it at that, but I want you to do some digging, and what extra proteins you do not want to attract to yourself. The body's adaptogenic response when used with adaptogenic herbs, or the herbs, the way they provide that response for the body, helps the body to adjust on a metabolism level, on an immune system level, and so what I decided to do was random thought. So it comes in a little bag like this. Now I want you to do a little Google search, DuckDuckGo search, maybe DuckDuckGo, on ashwagandha. So here's my little tea bag. And I just put it in. And I let it steep and I mix it around with my um, water, my lemon, and my ningxia. And with the cool water and the ice you know, the iced, little iced lemon cubes that we did here. It's been the most amazing, refreshing drink, especially at 40 degrees, you guys. <laughs> I planted a garden and it's going well, but we need the water here. It will cook the leaves. The soil might be moist, but I need to make sure they stay well because my own garden, my own foods makes me feel happy. So that is kind of your nutshell, very quick version of Ninja Red. So between the two of these amazing little tools, your body, and if you want it, and the other thing I was going to say is you can get stevia and you can add it just for a little sweetener. So if you want to up your fresh squeezed lemon in it, you can add a few drops of stevia. Um, it's good for people that need to make sure their blood sugar is balanced in the right way. So it's, it's going to help that in a very um, positive way. Um, some people don't like stevia. That's okay. You could probably use a little maple syrup if you wanted just a little bit um, more of a sweetness to it because um, the ashwagandha is very kind of uh, woodsy, peppery, that sort of thing. So... Anyways, and then you can also add your lemon oil to your water if you choose to do it that way. So this is just a drink that I thought is gathering up the most amazing um, benefits of the two. The glutathione to help de detoxify the body, the adaptogenic herbs to help detoxify that whole, it's working with wherever you need it, right? Some of the other adaptogenic um, herbs or foods that you can eat are garlic, again, high in sulfur, um, ginkgo, and ginseng, other forms of ginseng. So I hope this was useful. I am gonna add my water and then we're gonna go use up the rest of the water on the lawn and then we're gonna go get some more. So, um, hi, my little guy is here showing me his artwork. So this is a little bit of a, some of his really, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of KiwiCo but this is one of his many boxes that his auntie got him. And this is the coolest little artwork. Good job. Thanks, Mom. There. So, anyways, post me some questions. Um, if you have any curiosity about this, if not, use DuckDuckGo to go Google extra proteins and uh, with the current environment. Or just message me and I can give you the details. But, um, yeah, take care of yourself. Stay high vibing, good music, happy people. And uh, be sure to keep sending any questions and I will see you. Actually, one quick tip, one quick exciting thing is tomorrow is the pre-launch to our virtual convention happening again. It's already been a year, but our National Grand Convention, again, virtual is starting this week. So I will be back this week with a lot of the other cool stuff that's coming for new products.
So anyways, take care. And as my dear friend Mindy says, keep being amazing.